Now, in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to solve the Rubik's Cube 3x3x3. Three by three by three. But you have to have already solved the green side first and second layer and the completed blue cross. And so after you've done that, there are only two more steps to solving the completed Rubik's Cube 3x3x3. Three by three by three. Okay? So, now, just find it. Any of the pieces is um, the top pieces that are in the right position, which um, is quite easy to remember how to know if they're in the right position because this is the white, red, and blue piece, and this is the white, red, and blue side. So it's in between those, okay? So this piece is in the right spot. Now, if you don't have any pieces in the right spot, perform the algorithm that I am about to show you. Okay? Um, and if you do have a piece that is in the right spot, you are also going to be showing the, be doing the same algorithm that I'm going to be showing you how to get the, um, piece in the right spot, okay? So same algorithm for both, okay? It is U R U primed L primed um U R primed U primed L, okay? Now um, all of your pieces should be in the right spot. If they aren't, well then, um, I don't know what to say, just do it again, which I have to do because not all my pieces are in the right spot, okay? You are U primed, L primed, U, um, R primed, U primed, L. Now, all of your pieces should be in the right spot, which thankfully mine are, okay? Um, now, so you finished that step. Now, the last step, okay? How to put these corners in right here where these are okay now the algorithm that I'm about to show you should only have to be done two times or four times but when you already have these two corners or just one corner or all of the corners solved it usually takes about more than four times usually about six times okay you are still going to be doing the algorithms to put these in the right spot for these because it won't work unless you do it okay so put your left thumb on the red side and hold it there the whole entire time because this is going to be seems like it's going to be messed up which and it will be completely messed up and all hope will be lost if you let go of the reds. But in the last turns, it will all magically appear good if you hold on with the red side, okay? So now, red side looking at you, green side on the bottom, blue side on the top, and that piece that is in the right spot on the top left, on uh, top right hand corner, and then perform this algorithm. R primed, D primed, R, D. 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 Now that one took a long time 
because it was already solved. But you had to do that, okay? It may not seem like it did anything, but it did, okay? So now, with this still hold there, flip it once more. Okay, so the blue cross will be um, not a completed blue cross, but as I said, again, it will all magically appear good at the very end. R primed, D primed, R, D, R primed, D primed, R, D. So that one only took t two times. Now this one, R primed, D primed, R, D, R primed, D primed, R, D, R primed, D primed, R, D, R primed, D primed, R, D. Now, I didn't have to do that last corner piece um, because I actually don't know why. But now, it doesn't take a genius to figure out the last step. Just do U2, the algorithm U2, and you have the solved Rubik's Cube. 3 by 3 by 3.